Hi guys and welcome back to another video. As you can see, we have some albums here today. It's a pretty small haul. It's just a few signed albums and a fan signed album that I received. Um, so it should be pretty short and quick, but honestly, every time that I say it's going to be short and quick or I think that the video ends up being quite long, um, but that's okay. So here I have One Wee's uh, first full album one. I got two copies signed from M-Wave. Um, and I honestly don't even know why I got to. Oh, it's a little dented here. I think both copies came dented. Um, but, you know, that's okay. We work with what we got. I can't really identify anyone's um, signatures yet. I can only recognize Kia's and Youngun's. But, oh my goodness, these signatures are so cute. But, yeah, I don't really know why I got two. I just got two for some reason. Um, so, I'm probably, maybe in the future, will sell it off. I don't know yet. Um, I am looking for a way to protect this album so I think I'm gonna go ahead and buy like the large magazine protectors and see if that will fit for this album so that way the album's like nice and protected. I do like to protect all my signed albums just to preserve them and the signatures as well. Okay, let's go ahead and see what our pulls are. Okay, so we have a Kangen's card, and I believe this is one that I needed as well to complete his uh, photo cards for this album. And then I also bought Kia's photo card recently, so I'm only missing one of his photo cards. And then I'm missing an entire set for Dongmin. <gasps> Speaking of Dongmin, literally look, wow, what is this look today? This is unbelievable i'm so glad i pulled him um i bought five albums originally to try and pull a full set but literally i pulled the same photo cards for yangun and harden over and over again um, and i did try to trade them away but that was actually really hard since there weren't many people that bought the albums um in the u.s so it was unbelievably hard to find trades since most people that i did find ended up pulling the same photo cards that i did so i'm hoping to finally finish this set soon <sighs> when we recently had their online concert and i sincerely really really regret not buying it um and just watching their online concert because i saw clips after on twitter and oh my goodness it was so good Dongmin's other photo card. That is uh, 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 so exciting. Okay, so now we're only missing um, Kia's card, his other photo card. Let's go ahead and see if I can pull it today. N not today. I pulled another Kangen card, so I'm gonna go ahead and try and trade that away, but I don't think I'll have much luck, so I'll probably end up having to wait a while to see if anyone will trade or will sell his other photo card. But yes, this is so exciting. I pulled Dongmin. I feel like the hardest members to pull were definitely Kia and Dongmin. I didn't see too many people that pulled them. And then next up, I have N Flying's um, Zo album in the communication version. So I'm gonna go ahead and open these. There we go. And let's go ahead and see what our pulls are. I definitely want to collect all the N Flying albums, but I don't think I will collect photo cards. So far, I haven't put my current photo cards up for trade yet because um, I just haven't been able to let go of the collection yet. But we will see eventually, right? All right, for my pull, I pulled Jaehan's photo card, and I don't have this one actually. Um, so that's really exciting. But then I got. Like, I got two of these square cards that you're supposed to use to verify your album. It's supposed to come with, like, one of these oval-ish photo cards, but I guess I got gypped and got two of these square cards instead. So, like, I mean, oh well, I guess. There's not much I can do. I bought this version because I loved their photos so much. Like, look how adorable they are. Like, how can you not love People need to stop sleeping on and flying, man. I always struggle with these tabs so much. So I do have a duplicate because I have a unsigned version and a signed version. So I think I might go ahead and sell my unsigned version later on. I have so many duplicates that I honestly need to sell, but they've just been sitting on my shelves. Okay, I'm gonna do this off camera because this is kind of a struggle. 
I got it off camera and yeah, I'll definitely be putting this in a protector as well. Okay, next up we have my fan sign albums. So I won a fan sign for great guys. If you guys don't know who they are, please check them out. I love them so, so much. My favorite song from them is actually Be On You and guys that music video is poppin'. You guys should really check it out. I highly recommend it. They're adorable and so lovable. So this one wasn't my signed one. This one was my normal one that I bought. I bought three normal albums um, and so I received one that was signed and two that were unsigned. And yeah, just look at the massive size of this thing. It honestly looks like a record more than it does an album from its like massive size. I've never seen an album this large other than Golden Child's like Wish and then Reboot and then Take a Leap. Is this one my signed one? I'm gonna go ahead and take a look. These were definitely bubble wrapped well. That's so nice to see. I honestly don't know what I'm gonna do with the duplicates for this one as well. Okay, so it looks like this one is the unsigned version as well. Just gonna go ahead and put that to the side. So this one is definitely my signed one. This is <gasps> exciting. I definitely know 100% that there isn't a like protective sleeve big enough for this album. So I'm gonna have to figure out what to do. Okay, last layer of bubble wrap. I'm so glad that they bubble wrapped this so, so well. Okay, there we go. Oh my goodness, look at all those gorgeous signatures. So in my fan sign, I got two minutes with each member and there's a total of nine members. So my call ended up being around 20 minutes. They even signed it to my name up top. That's, my soul is literally singing. I am so happy right now. All right, let's go ahead and take a look at what this album looks like. It's so gorgeous. I love the inside. I love the design. It's like simple but very aesthetic. And then you get this film strip as well. It's so cute. And then instead of getting a photo book, I believe you get like individual member like posters or like very, very large photos. In the Summer is literally so good, guys. You guys need to take a listen to that song. It's so cute. And they did this like cute like self-filmed um, music video to it it's literally so cute and then here we have the photos they're literally so gorgeous like look at them in the middle of like all the like green with the leaves and everything and then the flowers so cute so so cute oh my goodness while i was talking to horyoung um I literally told him that his hair was gorgeous and that he should stick with red hair forever and he's like, wow, you really like it that much? And I was like, yeah. <laughs> oh my goodness. Hanel was literally such a flirt. He told me I was beautiful and in my head I was like, what a freaking liar. I'm sure you say this to every single girl. You're trying to take my money um, and it's working. 100%. But yeah they were definitely so cute during the fan call it was adorable i did record it but because it was through cacao talk and the audio didn't record i know one of those apps doesn't let you record the audio um so yeah the audio wasn't recorded and i didn't have another phone to record the audio and then combine it so i just saved the video only which is okay because you know all the audio is ingrained in my head um so i'm just gonna watch it without sound and relive those moments. I honestly can't even believe that I was able to participate in a fan sign. Um, I feel like I always see other people get these opportunities and I just never thought it would happen to me because I've never been able to afford like many, many copies like most people. But yeah, I guess that's the downside of being a multi-stan because my money is spread out very, very thinly versus like standing only like one or two groups and having a much larger budget for each group. Oh my goodness, I told Dongin that I really liked his tattoos and that they were so meaningful and he literally pulled out his arm and like showed off his tattoos and I was like, oh my goodness, yes. Okay, you're beautiful, goodbye. And honestly, guys, by the end of the video call, I was literally so red. You could see the difference. 
you could literally see the red peeking through from under my foundation and makeup like i was so red that i literally looked like a stop sign even with makeup on it was unbelievable like i would totally show a photo but i don't want to clown myself like that so we're just gonna i think you guys can imagine how red i was all right so that was the end for the photos i definitely rambled a lot about the video call um yeah it was honestly such a blessing and i'll forever remember my first experience in a fan sign and then here we have the cd i love the shade of color and like the design for the cd it's so like pretty and then i believe the photo cards are in this little pocket and i believe you get a full set as well so you get one for every member which i love i would love if every single album came with a full set of member photo cards versus having to pull random and then having to pay extra money for photo cards and buying more albums um because it's literally just a money grab from the entertainment companies to take more of our money but you know what we are clowns for doing it anyways because we love our group so so much but literally look at these photo cards so freaking cute um yeah i don't know if i want to store them in an album or leave them in the album yet these are really gorgeous because i don't think i'll plan on collecting all of their photo cards so yeah but i also don't want to give up this full set because it's absolutely adorable so i don't know what to do should i just have one page of great guys i don't know gonna go ahead and slide this back in okay so i think i figured out how i'm gonna sleeve this so the other ones came packaged in this like plastic thing so i went ahead and cut it open and i'm gonna use this to protect it because i'm pretty sure i won't be able to find one big enough for this unless i buy like vinyl sleeves or like vinyl protectors um but i don't collect vinyl so i don't feel like i should spend money to buy it and then just waste it and leave it sitting in my room so i'm just gonna go ahead and use this for now because we are thrifty and creative and diy queens if i can get this album in that is oh my goodness this is definitely a tight fit Okay, let's try it the other way and see if I can get it. Oh, did I do it? Did I do it? Oh, I did it! Finally, sorry you guys had to watch me struggle for like ever. And yay! I love it. All nice and protected. Anyways, that is the end of this video, guys. I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye!